What is up guys welcome back to another episode of Amazing Trading Methods. So before we get into this video, if this video reaches 70 likes, I will have an episode of Trading to 1 million tomorrow. I am so close to that 1 million mark in only 10 episodes. I have like 10 episode, episodes on the channel. If this video reaches 70 likes, I will have an episode up tomorrow. Uh, and yeah, if this video of course reaches 70 likes, I'm going to record a little bit tomorrow, edit it all down, and then it will be ready for uploading tomorrow. So this video if this video reaches 70 likes i will have an episode of trading to 1 million tomorrow i'm so excited to show you guys that episode because i have a lot of great deals i'll make tons of coins and it's, i can just i can just promise you guys it's the best episode yet so hit that like button for a trading to 1 million episode tomorrow so that is the intro then so today we are going to do the cm to striker method this method is really awesome so good i can't even think you guys what did i just say thank you guys uh i can't even believe it <laughs> that was weird um i can't even believe how great this method is i just discovered it i believe two days ago uh on thursday i believe it was and so amazing Meth this method is crazy i have done this method so much in my training to 1 million series that you guys will see tomorrow if this video reaches 70 likes so let's get straight on to it so first of all, you know the player Diego, I have traded so much with this guy, it's not even funny, I've traded so much with this guy, it's just even better to trade with him with this method. So he is a default CAM, but since he doesn't have that many cards on the market, you can basically just type in striker and he will come up with not many, uh, not many cards here. As you can see here, 6k, 6.9k and 1k. So basically what you want to do, you want to add this to your uh, transfer list and I know they won't go for 6.5k and above, they will go for under that. So that will mean that you will be looking to pick this guy up for under 6.5k and sell him um, for, you know, like 6k or something like that. Now, I think I'm going to have hiccups here. Uh, but yeah, so you basically will add uh, the players that are in open bid to your transfer targets and there aren't that many people usually searching for this so sometimes you will even find an open buy uh, by now for like 1.5k i'm going to give you guys a little spoiler for the video tomorrow i picked up like 10 diegos in striker for under 2000 coins i made like 30k yeah, I made tons of coins with this method you will see that tomorrow guys if this video reaches 70 likes so yeah uh, another method or another player to do this with is Steven Gerrard. He will definitely sell in the striker position. I have done this with him as well. So get this video to 70 likes to see the methods working for tomorrow. And as you can see here, uh, 6k is the cheapest. It seems it, it has no good uh, on bids. So basically, you wanna you don't want to pick up any of these. You just want to wait until there is a better player coming up on the market. We have another player called Sanders that just popped up to my mind. And he's default a CM. Let's see. Okay, there's one here for 3.5k. I would not pick that up. Uh, it's a Hunter chemistry style. So actually, I would pick that up. But the rule is that I'm not going to pick up any players in my uh, Amazing Training Method series. Unless it's a very, very, very good method uh, or a deal. So, uh, if you pick this one up, you'll maybe be able to make 1k most, but seriously, I would pick him up if he was like under 2k, then he will definitely sell on. So, one more play, let's do this with Fellaini. You can do, basically, guys, you can do this with any center mid you want. For example, uh, yeah, Fellaini, just convert into this, or just check out how many there are on, the end, on a striker position. You can even do this with silver players. It's even better to do this with silver players, because then it will get less players up in the striker position. I'm not going to say this is a good method with, with the bronze players, but just find yourself a CM, and then search for him in a striker position. And if you want to do this the other way around, you can find a striker player and search for him in a CDM position. It works as well really, really good. Let's check if there's any Marwan Fellainis on the market in the striker position. Um, let's have a quick look here. Okay, so there's under one page. And he was extremely cheap. 3.9k. That was... That was Surprising, but as you can see there are a lot for 4 and 5k here, so I haven't picked that one up So that will mean that I haven't picked them up if they were from a 2.5k and uh, And lower than that so I'll be back in one second when I have found a few examples for you guys So yeah, I'll be back in one quick second 
Okay guys, I have a few examples. For example, let's do this with Paulinho. That was the first player that I found. Paulinho. So let's check out him in a striker position. Does he have any cards? He has a few cards right here. Uh, does he have more than two pages? So yes, he... No, it's exactly two pages. Seems like... Oh, 3k. Seems like it is the cheapest one. Uh, is that the cheapest one though? Uh, yes, it is 3k. So I would go out and if there are someone for like 1.5k or more, you could definitely make a nice 1k profit. So there is... Kabai as well. That is a great player to do this method with, I suppose. And uh, yeah, just found him as well. And as you can see, there's under one page of him. Is that a good deal? I'm not sure because that is. I'll be back in one second if that is a great deal. Okay, guys. So his cheapest buy now in a CAM on the PlayStation is 80k, and this is in a striker position. So that will mean that you could make like five, six k profit on that guy. So that would be amazing. And look at this. Guys, look at freaking this. We have Kabais here for 1.7, 1.8k, and 2.4k. If you pick up these, you can like sell them for double the price. That is unbelievable. Great player to do this with is Kabai. Is there anyone this with Ericsson? But as I said, you can choose whatever center mate you want. And uh, yeah, just uh, be comfortable with the player you're training with. That is one of the key rules. You need to do when you're trading, you need to have confidence in the player, uh, or uh, you need to have confidence when you trade, and you need to be patient, uh, patient, and you of course need to know the player, player's price and stuff. So Ericsson isn't a very good player to do this with because he's only going for 2k, so not really much of a point of that. I'll be back in one second when I have found another player. Okay guys, I'm just going to try to do this with Jack Wilshere. Let's see, is there any of him in a striker position? We will find out. Uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Uh, doesn't seem like it, or it's just the web app lagging. I think it's just the web app actually just lagging. There are only five, and as you can see, here, 3.6k. If you add this on the mark, uh, this year transfer list, you can pick that one up for uh, under 2k and make a nice 2k profit. As well, you can add that to your transfer list and pick up that one and make a nice 1k profit right there. And uh, yeah. That was basically the method, guys. I hope you enjoyed. Remember to hit 70 likes for tomorrow's episode of Trading to 1 Million. So, guys, so amazing. Uh, I'm just so pumped, basically, to bring you guys that episode. And, hey, guys, that was it for this time. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, drop a like, and I will see you guys, uh, yeah, tomorrow. Take care, guys.